This historic brick building on Ballard Avenue appears to the untrained eye to be an ordinary bar. But step inside and one will find a world filled with magic. We are in an old wandmaker shop. It was kind of its own meeting place, its own pub for wizards. And so it's been operating actually as a wizard pub um, since the early 1800s. Now it's known as the Splintered Wand. Co-owners Jeffrey Thaddeus Constantine Balch and Andrea Ravenholm Balch, a centuries old wizard and witch respectively, completely renovated the wand shop to create a gathering place for magical people of all ages. Some of our European compatriots believe that there is a whole class of just entirely non-magical people. We know that everyone has the potential. They need focus, they need attention, they need, they need magic. Of course, every witch and wizard needs a wand. Here folks can get one custom made on site. The wood is chosen based on your birth date. The core of the wand? Well, let's just say it selects you. They do it thusly. Right now they're talking, kind of sizing up the potential. Uh, and then they come to a decision, they're relatively civil about it. Sometimes we get ties and that's particularly awkward, but there it is. For those in need of a bite, the Splintered Wand offers a selection of English pub fare made with an American Northwest twist along with some dishes inspired by magical creatures. We're trying to make sure that all the, the, the wizards out there, that everybody can have something because our magic people may feel intimidating, but our food shouldn't be. Downstairs at the alchemist counter, potions class is in session. Witches and wizards can choose from 12 different potions, all available with or without alcohol. And this is an interactive experience, meaning you assemble each potion yourself. Welcome you. to the Splintered Wand Bar. So, I hear that you are here for a love potion today. Our theory behind all the drinks was to take a drink and be able to disassemble it and put it back together in a meaningful way. So we're trying to create a meaningful experience here for you to think about where you are, what's going on and um, to kind of create an energy that you can take forward. All this love is pouring out. For those looking for something more personal, each potion can become a spell with the addition of more intention and perhaps an extra ingredient or two. If you want to fall in love with someone or you want someone to fall in love with you, we may need something from them. Or a name or, a, or yeah, a piece of hair. If you'd prefer to avoid the spells, the Splintered Wand offers mead, sparkling mead, even absinthe. This is, after all, a pub, a place where people can come together and discover the magic that exists inside us all. I want them to walk out of here really feeling that magic has entered their life. For Seattle Refined, I'm Brandon Bernstead.